Hello everyone, welcome to today's mission, which will lead us on this onto the Seavish front. I went to the Land of Mercy because I was the only hex, only frontline hex, without an insane queue to it. <laughs> Pretty much every other frontline hex had between 5, which is okay, and 30 people in queue, so I just chose the one with no queue. I hope I can find a good uh, frontline. Uh, for now, I've seen that there is not really medical supplies. But I have found a place where there is, so I'm going to walk there first and hope I can grab a few trauma kits because that's gonna be very necessary very soon, I think. I don't know how well this frontline is actually doing. So I'm very excited for what today will bring. How are you guys doing? How was the work week? I hope you're having a wonderful weekend now. Map. Uh, okay, it's actually not as far as I feared it would be, but still a little bit of a track. I'm going to grab multiple trauma kits so that we can deposit them in the town hall, just in case. It's better to have them a bit closer to the front. As usual, please let me know if there's anything wonky with the audio. Turtlefish! Thank you very much for resubscribing! Three months already! Yay! A big warm hug to you, Cuddlefish. Thank you very, very much. How are you doing? Okay, I think we're getting close. Very close. There it is. Give me them trauma kids! Ah! Ah, this feels better. Mm, I better not take any of the medical suits there. You just bought Stellaris, it's on sale. Nice, I hope you enjoy it. Are you excited about any specific point in Stellaris? Ah, uh, I'm I'm fat now. Whoops. Just two percent over. Dang it. Oh well. We're just gonna have to take a comfy little walk to the front, or rather to the town hall. It, uh... By the way, on YouTube, I finally managed to up uh, to schedule every video from 2022. So I'm now starting to schedule the videos from 2023, which means we are getting very close to being caught up on the video footage, which means that soon I'll be able to do more than just add an ending and an opening. I'll be able to actually do tiny editings. I'm very excited about that. Plus, I'll have more free time once that is over. I'm too heavy, but thank you. Plan on making a galactic empire on a whim. Might end up exterminating all life. Haven't decided yet. Standard hard decisions. Yep. If you do make a galactic empire and you decide to exterminate all life, how about you call it the empire of failure? Could make it a cult. I've heard a lot of good things about Stellaris, but I've yet to actually play it or watch any gameplay. There's way too many good games out. Are there any specific games that you guys want me to play? I have a few on the immediate list that I really want to play soon. But there's, there's always space to add some more to the immediate list.
I feel like I'm just taking a wonderful comfy walk. Missing my tea or the warm broth. <laughs> Maybe I should have left one of the trauma kits behind. But it's too late now, we're almost there. I think. Yep, almost there. Once I have a little bit more time, I was thinking of finally doing the redesign of my overlay. And also creating something like chat blockers. Would you actually think that it would be important enough to have a chat blocker, maybe even a squad blocker for Foxhole? So that people can't see chat and maybe squad? At least right now there's nothing of importance in squad. <laughs> so that would be what I would block. So there we go. And we have some trauma kits. Goodness. And not really anything else. It's hard for me to game as well. Time zone is not only the only issue. Ah, my brain is so fried after this work week. You know, I have so little gear. How about a lucky bucket? And not only lucky bucket. Let me see if there's a well. Hmm, I don't know what the sign for well is. I don't think it's anywhere here, but there should be a well in every area, so where is the well? Sometimes it's a little bit outside of the area. Oh yeah, cuttlefish. Um, my birthday week is actually coming up next month. So if you want any game and want to actually join me for that game, you have to let me know, um, preferably via Hammer Time, what time and game would you would prefer. I may just be able to fit it into my schedule. Cannot find the well. I really thought it was... there. there's a circle. Hmm. Well. Well, 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 apparently that circle does not mean well. <laughs> it always makes me giggle when I when I have to use hammer time. I mean by now it's a kinda old joke. But it literally just is a is a page that allows the conversion of time zones without any issues. It's still a month to go for my birthday. <laughs> a whole month! Можешь до фронта довести, нет? It was I. Um, it really is just a very useful tool for time zone conversion. But yeah, it has a very, very great name. I actually use it quite a lot and uh, people usually don't notice and then ask me what that would be in their time zone. I'm like, it, it shows you the time in your time zone so it makes it easy to communicate. <laughs> people are slowly getting used to it, on my Discord at least. I would just at this point um, put a, a clock, an extra clock up. I have one for Mike's time zone, it's not that hard to make an extra clock. But yeah, I can I can understand. There's some time zones you just keep in your mind. Um, 
I keep forgetting time zones, so for me it's a lot better to use either a clock or just hammer time it. Hey. You're doing a good job. Well, it currently is about 8 p.m. for me, so probably. You're doing good. I'm surprised we have that many medics, considering the state of our medical supplies. But then again, having many med medics also zaps a lot of the supplies. I did not think this would be a bridge battle though. Okay, me not lucky. You got this. Doing a good job. You say lunch break? I currently have my dinner right next to me. Didn't manage to eat it before stream. Stop. Hey. There you go. Do you already have any plans for your lunch break? Oh, is it behind us? Yeah, it is. Oh yeah, we need to clear that. Okay. That is definitely behind us. Oh, just some instant noodles and a piece of toast. I love dunking the toast into the soup from the instant noodles. Very tasty. Ah! No! I didn't think they'd be up there! Ah! No! I'm sorry! Ah! Too many collies! You've got this, guys! I did it! Proud of my guys. I've read hash browns a lot and I still don't understand it. What are hash browns? What is that? It sounds so weird to me. Hash brown. Then again, one of my favorite breakfasts, Molina, sounds weird as hell to me as well. It sounds a lot different in German. Hey, just because I'm German doesn't mean that non-German words aren't weird to me. In fact, a lot of non-German words are weird to me. Which reminds me that I'm very surprised that none of you uh, have yet redeemed anything from the... Let me say something. That made me say something in German. <laughs> I think one time it was redeemed, but... A long time ago. <laughs> I still refuse to put up a talk German for five minute thing or something like Fox had. Ugh, I don't like my own language. Oh no, the bike! The poor bike. Oh 
which reminds me, there's this YouTuber, Uye Nin, that I really like watching. She moved to Germany and she makes this, this shorts, these little skits about life in Germany as a Vietnamese. It's sometimes really hilarious. And not too long ago, she made a, a little video about the three most hardest thing to say. And there was two situations. And then it was Streichholzschächtelchen. <laughs> and it actually sounded hilarious how she tried to say it. I can't imagine that for a non-German that is actually a pretty harsh word to say. Although I do find that Swedish or Finnish words are a lot harder to pronounce. But just because they're harder doesn't mean that German is easy. Uh, is that one trying to bridge it? I'm not sure that's a good idea. Okay, so we have medics over there. Got a tank there. Oh! More oh, wow! Yeah, apparently we have some- Oh! So that's why we have such a collie problem here. They are up there. Nice. You guys are doing a great job. Yeah. <laughs> hmm, I remember. It's actually on YouTube right now. But last time we were here, we had a bridge going up here, I think. I don't think there's a friendly there. Ooh. Nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. Thank you. go there from here. And I don't think there's any friendlies up there. Well, let's get complimented, I'd say. Gotta throw some morale around. You guys are doing great. Hmm. Well, since everyone here is healthy, I'm just going to check the other bridge again. Maybe I'll go to the other bridge side. Mm -hmm. I guess they're going to build. Lock the bridge, please. Here you are, please. Don't lock. In German, are you expected to learn other languages? Yes, we are. Um, you actually um, have, have a choice what languages you want to learn. If you go to the highest grade of education, you need to learn Latin and English. And all lower grades have English, and you can learn, for example, French is a very popular language to teach, which I had in third grade, but uh, didn't take afterwards. Um, Spanish is another uh, that you can have when you go to the highest grade of education, or to the middle grade of education, I never had the option. And Chinese is one you get when you go to the highest grade of education. I think there may be more, but those are the only ones that I've been confronted in, on, with so far. Yeah, sorry Frazzles, I never got the option to learn that. I did 
did learn a few words in French though, but since I uh, was like, what, eight, nine years old back then, we learned there words like bonbon. There, bon. <laughs> there is Hammer in the truck. And Bluemots behind us. Mostly we learned that because candy in German is bonbon, which is basically the two French words bon together. So. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Obviously, it is mandatory here to learn German. Kinda. <laughs> and English. So, um, I don't think anyone can go to school here and not learn English. In fact, a lot of the newer generations of students, it started with my generation, I think, had so much contact with the English language. That their English is better than that of their teachers. I always fought with my teachers. We need more bullets, thank you. Can you do it? We need more No, bullets. no. The German word bonbon means candy in English. And the French word bon is basically what's what the German word bonbon is made out, out of. Yo! Who's got the cutler? Who's got the cutler? So yeah, if you want to have a candy in German, you ask for a bonbon. You got this. Nade! We have not got this. Yeah, hold on. Hold on, bro. I'm getting, I'm getting about 20 bomber stones thrown out at me. Oh, he's dead. Leading. I'm a medic. Is anybody at 12 millimeter? You're doing a great job here, guys. What the fuck? Boop! Hi, Nutty Fairy, how are you doing? I changed my headpad thingy. Can you give me a headpad, Naughty? Let's join the boats. Let's I'm doing quite boats. well as well. I mean, it's weekend now. It's weekend! You can't build the bridge with a CV. You can't build the bridge with a CV. <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> let's, let's, come in, come in, come in. Come in the boats. I need to implement more like that. I love that. I love the squeaky sound that I put on there as well. <laughs> oh. I'm a medic. I got you, buddy. There we go. Take equipment back. Take ammo back. Always salvage. You've got this, guys. There's a hurty guy. We are the winning. Nope. Not hurty we anymore. We are the winning. Nya, nya. You back? You've been a nuisance sometimes in ESO, and you're still a nuisance here. My favorite is sort of the yellow. <laughs> oh, I miss seal. Oh wait. I've got you. And these needs. You guys are doing a great job here. Vivek! Vivek, you're still wounded! I, I need to get these other guys. Ah. Let's go! Thank you. You're doing good. Ah. 
I have I have medic supplies. Anybody need? Check the bodies. They have medical supplies on them. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't know where to go. Ha! Jane, Jane, we we will fight. Mm. Oh, don't push. You don't have to the bolt. Only with two. Okay, let's see if there's any... Oh, Vivek must have checked them just now. Ah! AI other AI. There's no rescuing AI death. No, no. I won't be able to get to Toxic over there. Good thing he had a bandage. Hope we can push away from this bridge soon. Which reminds me... Apparently these guys gave up trying to build the bridge. Well, it doesn't help that I stood on the bridge for a while. But I also didn't see a blueprint go up while I didn't stand there. So slow. Is it drifting? Then it wouldn't be making that sound there. Maybe I got this. Yeah, we really have to be careful that we don't go too close to AI, but we still have to kind of get rid of it. I hope the boat is bringing people over there. And by the backpacks, it looks like it is. And then these boats can take care of that. Which is probably why that AI is already pretty hurt. Well, I'm going to check on the other bridge then, since I can't really do much here right now. You guys are doing a great job. You're doing good. No more hearty. Me no likey. I don't want to go squish. I don't want to go squish. Huh. A lot was going on here now. Yep. You're doing a good job. I'm very well supplied, so I'm going to go back over the bridge just, just like this. Maybe I can drop some bandages for you back. Ah. I do not have a gas mask. Liberty, save me. Save my machine gun. Oh, don't let me bleed out. No, use my weapons. <laughs> Ow. Medic down. At least I got the backpack down here. Oh, wait. How am I not down, actually? I think we can protect the machine gun until the guy is back.
I think I didn't die or even get hurt because uh, <laughs> the guy was basically my shield. <laughs> ah, always useful to have a meat shield. Come on, guys! Come on, guys! Join, join! We we will flank. Join, join my boat. I think you have come to go on, further on. back where the people are actually closer to the base and can grab some mammoths. Yeah, give me one sec, I'm getting my medic stuff. Come on. You guys are doing a great job here. Come on, come on, come on. Join, join. Mark it to zero. Back, join. This time I'm down. <laughs> this time I'm definitely down. Oh well, I've got medical supplies and Vivek is there. I don't know if I should grab a completely new kit. There's a lot of stuff on the front after all. Maybe I'll just grab... Maybe I'll just try a cops run. I could. Now I'm gonna grab a full kit. But I think I'm gonna set spawn to closer to the front after this. And next time I try a corpse run. Okay, jokes on me. Um Jokes on me. Corpse run it is. <laughs> Or if you conflict are trying to do bridge fights, they're sometimes not worth winning. I mean, we are kind of fighting our way from the bridge to land. So it's not just a boring bridge half to bridge half fight. I do love it when we push from the bridge. That's that's one of my favorite parts. Ooh, boy. No! <laughs> Just a second. Ah! Dang it. Well, since I'm stuck for 20 seconds in respawn, I'm just gonna watch that guy and eat noodles. Okay, these noodles were tasty. Now, second try. I think I'm gonna check here if I can re-equip. exactly stellar gear but well it's better than nothing okay let's see that I don't get squished this time you're doing a good job Mm. 
I think gates now close automatically. I don't know if it was now or next update, uh, or if that actually gets implemented, but I heard that that will be implemented. Which would probably be very useful against grieving. Hi. You're doing a good job. Thank you. Oh, looky, my backpack and body. Not hurt, I think. Keep fighting, guys. Oh! I'll be back with. <laughs> Bring hey, some uh, shit, please. Should we try, should we get, try to get artil <laughs> counter artillery fire at <laughs> any position? Because. I bring, uh... grenades. I bring grenades, okay? And more uh, of everything. Uh, I okay, I can't spawn here. There's no gear here, here at all. Sure I'd rather that, spawn uh, at the other turn uh, sure not turn hall, bunker base. Now let's see if there's still any gear I can take from across the bridge. Gate's too close now after 10 seconds. That is really useful. It's also very good because I'm one of these people that really suck at closing the gates behind them. Thank you. Now to find my old medical gear. Ah. Medicate. Yeah, I need bandages. I can't jump over. I need a trauma kit. Did anyone see my trauma kit? I got a trauma kit. Did you? Uh, do you have an extra? This backpack right here has uh, an extra trauma kit. Wonderful. I lost mine. Gas, gas, gas. Ah! Bleeding! Try and bring back ammo. I'm bleeding! Uh, I need to grab bandages, but gas is kind of. No! My gear! I'm bleeding. I hope my gear doesn't fall into the water. Help! I'm bleeding. Thank you. Thanks. Gr gas. <laughs> Pathfinder, come here. Pathfinder, come here. No, I'm sorry. I thought I was close enough to the wall. Nice. I'm going out of here. Probably best, yeah. That's a good idea. No! Thank you. Oof. That's why I jumped down here. Last words would they thank you, oh they my god. They have a tank. Guys, keep in mind, if you see a corpse flying from its position, run. Can I get a medic? Who needs a medic? Me. I'm bleeding. Sorry, I didn't see. You're doing a good job. Alright, thank you. Thank you so much. You guys are doing a good job here. Ah, seeing the message, gonna read it in a bit. A Just gonna check up here. Way. Okay. Okay. You've got this. Still doing quite well with bandages.
<laughs> I think it's a good idea that that was censored. Hola. My enemy. A meat shield. Brandil. <laughs> Okay, back to the front. <laughs> I mean, the guy can just give up if he ever gets tired of being carried around. You're not trapped in that situation. Okay. I've got you, buddy. You're doing a good job. The little I've been doing in Foxhole lately is playing as an infantry commander. I really enjoy teaching new players and being a vocal strategist. That is also a very important role. And I've had... Um, when, when Fox started playing, for the short time she played, I actually went through basic training with her and there was a guy that um, made these guided tours through, through basic training. And I think that helped a lot more people understand and take interest in the, the actual aspects that were covered in basic training and in the other trainings too, than would usually happen. So that was that was really good. So that is that is something really needed. Which is why Sally and I made a school regimen, it's just that we never have time to actually do something. So good job. You're doing a good job, Cuttlefish. going to be all right. We need more artillery, Jesus. Yep. <laughs> you, you were saying? Hmm. Well, he isn't going to be all right now anymore. At least his body is now a warning sign. If it starts flying, we know we'll run away oh from it. Oh boy, it's getting dark. No worries, they're gonna fly ours up in no time, I guess. Did someone call for a medic? Vivek is over there, so it should be fine. Have it? Oh, that must be the, the prisoner. Jersey, wait. Nice. Got You're doing good. Oh yeah, being a bootcamp commander is really fun. I taught over 30 players in a single day once. Going to have to glue that man back together. <laughs> you know, you could just scoop up all of the blood and make soldier golems out of them. Oh, I was friendly. Medic, medic, medic. Thank you. Oh, crazy. Go! You've got this. Don't hit that tank, please. <laughs> go, 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 go. <laughs> on the wall, on the wall. I should probably go over there. You're doing great, guys. 
51 minutes until I said something weird. Is that good or bad? Should I say something weird more often? Also, 51 minutes, that means I missed Stream Raiders. By over 20 minutes. Uh -oh. The hell's going on there? Help me. Ready. Ah! Damn it! Inspiring me. Dude had too much cake, I couldn't carry him. Damn it. If you if you run this they can't shot you. I I will mostrate to you. I will demonstrate. <laughs> See. See. You know blood golems don't exist. If they did, we'd make Roydens into proper gem soldiers. Yeah, he wasn't talking about his fingers <laughs> If they did exist, no. I'd be very happy Can't though. Your in here. Soldier golems! I mean, considering all of the mud and all of the blood that seeped into the mud. Does anybody have grenades? Or air launcher? They should exist. Uh, I have one grenade. Yeah. Do you want me to drop the grenade for you? Yeah, sure. Where are you? Yeah, actually, good point. Where the fuck are you? Who needs the grenade? Yeah, good throw, good throw. It's me, it's me, it's me. Okay, here, here, here. Oh my god. In the box. In the box. I've got you. Use it wisely. But yeah, 51 minutes since I said... Thank you. Until I said something weird. I need to up my game. I need to say more weird things then. The thing is, I can only think of weird things when I'm, well, not specifically trying to. Friendly fire. Okay, stream race is going again. The blood Thank is for the plants. The plants in Fox are vampiric, you know? Hmm, that's why I like the plant life so much. I'm pushing up to the rocks on the left. Three or four of them. Ow. Sorry. Is there a medic that can come down here? Yes, one right here. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes, yes, yes. No problem. Mm. Okay, I'm just gonna leave Vivek to this. Got this. Where's the medic needed? Uh, the best right here. No low supply. Ah, damn. I died in the gas. Ah, I need gas masks. But we had so few before. Hmm. Not a lot. Hmm. Ah! 
Still no gear, but uniforms. You guys are doing a great job here. a bunker base that I wanted to. Uh -oh. Hey Sammy. You doing good? Yeah, you're a good boy Sammy. Just gonna bring some more benches for the front base. Some wounded people running around before. To you too. Like, come on, y'all. Oh, thanks. Sorry. Yeah. Appreciate that. You're doing man. a good job. We gotta get that bunker thanks, Sam. Hmm. Nope, they're all healthy. Okay. All right. See y'all soon. They are healthy. That is so cool. So cool. <laughs> they have really upped their fight against grieving lately. Like really, really upped it. They've implemented so many things lately. But only in, in the last few weeks. But a lot of good ideas. I wonder how harshly the grief numbers actually went down from that. Oh dear. Well, I think there was a chest here. Park vehicles also can't block gates. They get moved when the gate closes. Oh. Okay. That is interesting oh, to hear. How does the other side of the bridge look? Can I go over there and get my trauma kit? Uh, Guess not. No. This is quite many. Well, I don't have a trauma kit. Yeah, I don't think we have any back here either. Yeah, I, I tried finding one, but nope. Yeah, I did too. I just went with a rifle. I couldn't find anything. And I, even at the base behind us there, they've got nothing for supplies. When I started here, I walked back to the uh, next uh, town hall and grabbed like six um, from there. They're all gone already. Yep. I'm just it going didn't to... didn't take very long with that bridge. Yeah. I'm just going to dump you somewhere so you can find your gear. Yes, I appreciate it. If anyone finds trauma kits, please bring them to your nearest medic or to a chest or to a base.
Oh, this is going to be interesting now. He may be a little bit in trouble here. We've got this, guys. Got both. There, there, there. If I may place an order, please kill an enemy medic. I need a trauma kit. Gas. You're doing great. Thank you. Sorry. Damn it. I don't have trauma kits, so you can just drop me at the nearest convenient place. I guess I'll do another run to the other uh, town. See if I can grab some more trauma kits. We don't have trauma kits. Trauma kit. Yep, that one. Exactly that one. <laughs> ah, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go run for more trauma kits. Let me just grab a bite of noodles. Nice, we got resupplied. Oh, nice! Trauma kits! I don't have to run. <sighs> I'll try to get my uh, bandages. Actually, yes, I'm gonna try and get my bandages completely back. Basically, corpse run. so cool when you're looking through stone now that you're actually seeing well kind of every outlines it is so cool I'm always happy at the most random of things
You're doing a good job. You've got this, guys. I love this place. I wonder if we can climb up there. If you can! <laughs> Damn it. Was it lightning just now? Cool. Dang it, I want to climb up there! Oh well. Seems like we're not doing so well right now. They have certainly made short work out of our bunker base. I don't know if it was actually lightning or if it was just a light effect from being inside while artillery hit. I think it was just lighting. But it, it looked kinda cool. What's going on? I'm gonna try a corpse run. Should be fairly easy to find my body actually surviving and getting my gear is a different thing there. Okay, it looks a lot more lively now. Now where is my body? I think I was a bit further front. There maybe? Yeah, call the entrench! Cops run and I can't find my gear. <laughs> medic, medic, medic. I'm doing a cops run and I can't find my gear. Never mind. I'm just gonna grab a new kit since I can't find my old one. I thought finding my cops was easy enough, but. I'm too much for over numbers to find my gear. Whoops. I was really confident I would find my body. <laughs> Where did I put my body? Oh, I did. I Where did I die? That I can't find my corpse. Hmm. 
I'm kind of puzzled. Okay, out we go again. You guys are doing a great job here. Thank you, bitch. Okay. Well, let's see that I can actually be useful. At least a little bit. Да фигня. Я, короче, с этим играю. Ну, он походу испанец. Зовут, ну, Алекс. Я что-то, ну, так бегал постоянно, умирал. Он приезжает ко мне на танкетке. Он, короче, вот. I'm so confused on my corpses. There we go. You guys are doing a great job here. Okay. Apple Bandit. You're doing good. I'm sure that my corpse was around here somewhere. Oh well. Let me just... Here. Yeah. You're doing a good job. You guys are doing great. Got you, buddy. You've got this. You're doing a good job. War melody. You're the best. <laughs> I just have to do jokes like that sometimes. I've been wanting to do that joke the whole time since I saw him, but it is corny to say. Ooh, I should probably not be closer there. Okay. It's not like we were under fire from the side. Not exactly something that I want to experience. Considering we are getting fired on from two and a half other sides.
You're doing good. <laughs> I could say that next time, yeah. You're the best around. Nothing's gonna ever keep you down. Well, I mean, it does, but not for longer than a minute. Something very low just dropped by. I've got you, buddy. That enemy is coming from behind. Southeast. You guys are doing a good job. <laughs> Frazzle's having a party. Okay, take it that's lyrics. And now I want to know from what song. Probably even know the song, just don't remember right now. <laughs> Try to go over there. Nade. Okay. Nade. Nades. It's raining explosives! Hallelujah! <laughs> ah, I thought it was far enough away. I'm bleeding. I'm bleeding! Someone else here carry a med pack. There we go. I need to. Stop healing. Let me walk. I'm going to be all right. I need to find more bandages or go back. I vote for finding. Got you, buddy. Haha. <laughs> no 
go and kill them. Medic down. Dang it. Yep, snack. Hi, Coquette. How are you doing? I went to London first, you know. I'm gonna be here for about another half hour if you want to join me. Maybe a bit longer if it's fun. Yep, apparently I am. I noticed that when I was logging in today. Apparently, I'm a lieutenant colonel now. I, I think that's that's how you say it. Lieutenant colonel. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, Cookhead. So do I, and I don't think much has changed in me since then. I've just gotten lots of comments for some reason. Okay, let's stream writers. I'm gonna do one more stream writers battle and I'm gonna shut that down. Nah, I doubt it. I highly doubt it. It took me a little while to get to uh, Lieutenant Colonel, although it was a lot faster than I expected. But it did take me a little while, so... The next is gonna take, uh, is needs more commands, so it's gonna take a while. <laughs> Speaking of which, that game I got you has all the DLCs on it. Wow. I was planning on maybe playing that next month. Still have to figure out the exact um, the exact time. Also, since I don't really have any idea right now what kind of game it is, I have to test it before. But yeah, look uh, look forward to next month. I mean, you bought it for that, so. <laughs> uh, they are throwing lots of gas. We don't have any masks. Great. Yeah, I'm just going to go in there to die anyways. You guys are doing a great job here. Now I'm just gonna uh, probably do the tutorial if there is one. And that's about it. I mean, I have to test if it runs anyways. But yeah, I'm currently um, collecting ideas for a short list of games that I will want to play next month. I already put that one down for you, but if you have any other that you also want me to play, as a second priority, then I will write that down and maybe take it into the list as well. Some countries say it like left lieutenant, uh, but lieutenant, but lieutenant is how Americans say it. Well, uh, most of my military knowledge comes from America. In Germany, uh, let's just say I didn't know that a military existed in Germany until I was like 16. Oh, no, my gear. Oh my gear! Um. So I have a problem. Can anyone get me out of here? What do I do now? Well, so apparently, I'm not the only one. <laughs> 
considering that someone just literally swam past me <laughs> through the earth. <laughs> Well, at least he's... Oh, wait. Can I lose stamina? I don't know if I can die from that, though. Funny German army. Depending on who you ask, Germany didn't really have an army until after the Berlin Wall fell. Well, I was born after the Berlin Wall fell, I think. Hmm. So... But yeah, when I was growing up, no one talked about the German army so I literally when I when I left school at 16 I didn't know and I didn't think that military actually was an option but it's partly also because my mom is a hardcore pacifist literally when I got bullied and I would tell her about it she would tell me to um, do what Jesus did and show them the other cheek which resulted in me filing my fingernail sharp so I could actually literally scratch them bloody because Show them the other chick. Eh. So yeah, um, even before I left school, my only military knowledge came from America. <laughs> Grade. There I go. Frazzles. I don't know why you would think that I'm low-key a psycho. But yeah, I also don't know why <laughs> why there's a cause there. <laughs> I don't know how much psycho I was during my teenage years. I think I was just normal, edgy teenager kind of thing. But I don't know. I can't judge it. I didn't have friends back there either, so but the, the first friendship I made was when I was 25. So I don't have anyone to actually judge that other than my mom and my mom is not good, um, yeah, that, whatever she says, add your own spice to it. Speaking of the German army, one, uh, one of the DLCs features the German army and you get to fight Russians with them. Okay. One of my favorite streamers, Tommy K, is also German and was in the German army during one of the wars in the Middle East. He has some interesting perspectives on in that experience. Well, uh, shortly after I left school, I started having an um, interest in military, but I, I never joined. Two reasons. My mom always was um, already pretty strict and I thought I could not deal with anyone being strict. And the other was I, I didn't mm, great. know if I could actually just join. I really should have. I really should have. That would have been way better than working in an old people's home. I actually had a friend that was in the army when I was like 23 But we only talked a, a few weeks Then he had to, to go to the deployment and then I've never seen him since then But then again, friend uh, was online, so Nowadays I'm a lot more closer with online people than I was back then <laughs> Got that you snack gamer girl in that order <laughs> Well, you're not wrong with that. And to be honest, if I would be more comfortable with my body, I would still be goth. Never the makeup or hair, no, but the clothes. I, I remember vividly when I went to town and I was like 14. And I went to the psychiatrist. And on my way back, I walked through the main railway station. There was just this uh, edgy clothing store. And they had these these very very high uh, high heeled oh, yeah. plateau boots that would go up until actually your thighs. 
and they they basically looked like they were made of nothing but belts. I wanted these boots so badly, <laughs> but mom wouldn't buy them for me, and um, I didn't have any money. <laughs> shall tape it. But that's that's the type of boots that I would want to wear. But well, since I don't like my body much, I'm not going to wear them anytime soon. <laughs> What's a KSK snack? I'm not gonna Tommy K said zombie. the German army was not very impressive. Yeah, from what I heard, they they didn't really okay, do anything so uh, from uh, in the German no. army until they actually I? deployed. I don't know what to call you. Nod. But that's because. German army wasn't really wanted for a long time. I'm gonna try and go in there. Actually, I'm gonna try and see if I can find my backpack. Nope. No! Well, I'm sure I can find my backpack now. I can't. Okay. Ah, that trench. Mm, that trench is not good. I need to stay away from that trench. And all the gears lost. Yeah, German bureaucracy is a witch. It is. Ah, special command. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to go to the trench anymore. I'm not. I'm I'm going to I'm going to take a wide berth around it. <laughs> not a good trench to go to. Nope. Uh -uh. That trench is not okay. Wasn't even me that cursed it. I wonder, I, actually I'm pretty sure if I would have grown up in a different country with a more openly accepted military, I most likely would have joined the military early on. Probably as early as I could just to get away from my mom. <laughs> ah, parental influence. It can hit really hard. Well, if you want to and we can figure out a time that fits both of us, then uh, when I play it during my birthday week, you can actually play with me. I don't know how many people can play together. We'll have to hash that out, but as far as I know, I don't think that too many of our people actually have that game anyways. But it would be great if we could find a full group. It's always fun with more people. Four, three, two, one. Oh god. Let's go! Hot damn, it was like right on zero. Good job. Uh, reviving takes 3.5 seconds, so it's possible, although complicated. Does anyone have an extra trauma kit? I lost mine in the cursed yeah. trench. Warm hug to you, cool guy. Big, big, big warm hug. Hope you're doing okay. Yes. Ah, my dear. Ah. <laughs> okay, now we need we need trauma cats. We need trauma cats. It's not exactly Trauma Kid Central. 
Any uh, trauma kits for me? Any trauma kits? Uh, Please? No? Okay. Can I borrow your truck? Yep. Want the lift to the next village? No. Room, room. You so zoomed me into lag. That is not... Mm. Okay. Tommy K also had strong words to describe German bureaucracy. <laughs> Does it guys to the stream? It sounds like someone I should talk with. <laughs> Actually, probably sounds like someone I should really talk with. Because I actually have been trying to get into... Uh, get permission to go into the army. But... due to my knees. It... it's really complicated. I really want to be a medic. And... If I could join the army, that would actually make it possible for me, because I don't have the money for all the curses. I, I just don't have the money. I've also been trying to get into an organization uh, uh, that would train me to be a medic and then would, would use me. Send me uh, somewhere. But they all basically want you to already have the knowledge. I'm sorry, cool cat. It's just, I really... I wish I would be a medic, you know? That's the only thing I can really say. I, I wish I would be a medic. And so I'm, I'm trying to be a medic now, and it's really hard. Even... But even if I if I do manage to to join the army or something, even if I do uh, go away for a while, I'll, I'll never be away for too far for too long. 
I mean, I've been streaming for what now? Seven... Uh, over seven years, I think? So don't worry. <laughs> I, I won't stay away. No, I think that's too close to the, to the road. Uh. But, well, first I would actually have to... to... manage to join. I mean, um, from what I've heard from the one guy I've known that was in, in the army, you were allowed to have your laptop and actually be online. So theoretically, I could stream from there. I think Jäger also does the same when he is on deployment. Uh, I should have that, that. Yep. That looks a lot better now. A lot better. But we don't have any bandages! <laughs> oh well. You guys are doing a great job here. But yeah, the chances of me actually joining any military organization are currently fairly low because no one wants me <laughs> so no matter how, how much i want it if no one wants me uh, you don't have to worry about me ever going away <laughs> if i could go back in time though i would join the German military as soon as I could. Being an actual medic on an actual front line. Actually, I probably shouldn't. carry so much with me. Also, I do have a little bit of knowledge, but it's not enough for them, and I do need to get trainings to have the level of knowledge that they want. So they're not willing to actually teach me. Which I understand, I totally understand, it's just that I don't have the money to get the training. I have trauma kit. Can you hear me here? I can't hear you before you drop him. I can't revive him, no! Out there! Thanks. Uh... Sorry. No! Why hast thou betrayed me? <laughs> Manga idea! My favorite female streamer is my commanding officer. That would actually be hilarious. But if I ever do get to join the military, I I don't want to be a commanding officer. Just let me be medic number 13 somewhere behind there in the corner doing her job. Thank you. I, I don't want any specific roles. Just, just let me heal. Just let me heal. I know that for lots of people, rank is, is important, and I know that in the military, rank is important, but I, I just want to heal. I don't care for anything else. I mean, I'm, I'm kind of obligated to care that they pay me a, a, as much money as I need to keep my apartment and my cats. But that's, that's about it. That's about it. <laughs> No! No, someone stole my trauma kids! I'm lucky. It was hard to get my trauma kids. <laughs> well, I did bring enough trauma kids, so hopefully there's still one of the that there. Why would someone just steal my trauma kit? I most likely have the wrong idea, but 
What can I say? We don't get taught anything about the military. In Germany, you literally get taught nothing about the military. I won't lie and try to hide that, I probably have no idea. I think that's pretty much impossible to do. Mm, don't feel right taking that. I'm gonna be like in my in my forties and I hear about a German female making general in the new German army. Hell no. Nightmare. <laughs> My favorite Warmer 40k fanfic, there's a romantic moment when two medics look into each other's eyes with elbow while elbow deep in the dude's cuts. I think I saw that. <laughs> uh. At least I, th I think I saw a drawing similar to that a while ago. Sharing a tender moment over the guts of someone. <laughs> I will never be an ex-gamer girl. Hell, I'll be gaming in, in my 90s if I survive that long. I'm not going to go close to that one. Uh-uh. Hell no. That death pit can stay away from me. You guys are doing a great job here. <laughs> I'm okay with that one, being an expert gamer girl. Hmm, that's a nice bit behind us. One's dead. Mm. I'm afraid of going further up. I probably should though. Job. Ah, that doesn't flow right.
You've got this, guys. That was close. Also, to be fair, when the words German military is uttered, it's usually a much more historic content. And that's the only bit I learned about military. And obviously, I always thought, hell no, I would, I would never join something like that. So... <laughs> you, you don't learn anything outside of history. And you don't learn anything outside of that specific part of history. <laughs> and that includes a lot of jobs that you don't hear about that still exist. But they just don't get talked about. Still, or again, like military. No! Ah! Check over there again. Maybe that changed until now? I mean, I haven't been to school in, what, 15 years? Give or take. So I hope that it changed by now, but when I was still in school, uh, we, we weren't really taught much. Plus, I I did the lowest grade of education. There's three grades, the lowest, middle, and highest. And then the, the highest one, you learn Latin, you uh, have a lot more school. In the lowest grade, you probably get taught, well, enough to, to get a normal job. The funny thing is, I would have gone to the highest grade of education if I didn't completely fail at an English exam when I was like nine. Okay, guys, let's start moving up. Infantry forward. Eee! I'm not going close to the death hole. No. Ah. When Fuzzle sees German military, the Gepard 1A2 comes to mind. Hmm. I'm just, I'm just gonna... Ooh, bandage. What's going on? You know, likey. My grandmother and father are Japanese. Having relations to access power sometimes results in weird moments. And I am now a tiny bit envious. Because I always wanted to be Japanese. But yeah, it's um... Ah! My gear! Oh, we can do a cop's run. But yeah, it's sometimes a bit weird. <laughs> uh, this is going to be my last life, I think. Because streamer is just gonna be in two minutes. Random, uh, but I just had to think that my mom has always told me that Ancestors Guild is a thing. All of Germany usually tells you that, that Ancestors Guild is a thing. It really annoys me. It really annoys me. I can't tell enough how much Ancestors Guild is not a thing and how much it annoys me. I hate that German children are basically raised to be guilty. We we learn so little when I when I look at history, we learn so little. Only focus on one specific moment in German history. And then we are being told that we are bad the whole way through. <laughs> There would have been so much more to learn. There is so much in history that is so interesting. There. Okay, last life. Do we have a lucky bucket? We do not have a lucky bucket here. But 
guess most would definitely be interesting. Let's see if we can grab a lucky bucket from over there. Там, кстати, пехота, по-моему, ушла с того места. Lucky bucket! Hey, Kel! Cuddles! Mm, you're a good girl. Mm? Yes, you're a good girl. Mm. Sweet Callahan. Mm? Mm? Yep. Oh, I love you, Callahan. Okay, lucky bucket, last life. Actually, let's wait 17 seconds and there's stream raiders. Ah, I probably won't reach the front line in 17 seconds. If I remember right, or if I have here right, you also have very bad annotation with German history. I mean, every once in a while you hear some interesting things in connection with Argentina and old Germany. <laughs> I have a Korean friend and his family is pretty racist towards Japan. Makes sense in a bigger context. It does, it is sad, but it does make sense. It's kind of funny how little we learn about Japan in general. And that's not even from German classes. I, I never heard about anything that Japan did. Any. At any time. But um, even even in general, we learn so little about it, and there's a lot of bad blood, <laughs> a lot of bad blood. That's exactly one of the reasons why I don't think that ancestors guild is is a thing or should ever be a thing. You can't pick and choose whose ancestors are the bad ones. I wish school would just teach logically. That would be awesome. It's a bit scary here. You're doing a good job. The other day I saw a guy traveling here to find Hitler. Guy even yelled Hitler, are you here? <laughs> I want to beat the frick out of that guy for being so idiotic. Yeah, uh, a few years ago, everyone basically uh, was talking about how, how Germans are still Nazis. How that is all still going on. And the funniest thing is, nowadays they are not talking about how that is still going on. Nowadays they are talking about that it was a hoax. This is... can't make their minds up and can't get history straight. It's very weird. Depending on who you listen to, it's just very weird. Okay, he's healthy. But luckily we do have the internet, which is both good and bad, but in this case... It... If, if a person has at least a little bit of curiosity, it's good because they can learn by themselves. Which personally I like. Ah! Ah! Well, that's it for me. <laughs> ah, jeez. And all we did was talk about history and, well, bad schools. I hope the talk wasn't too weird today. Please let me know if it was so I can try to avoid it soonish. I just kind of... I just kind of started talking about that and then it didn't go away. <laughs> I hope that was okay. Now then, who are we going to raid? I don't know if there's anyone online that is playing Foxhall that I know. Or is there a German military guy online? If it would even be okay for me to raid them. They're usually all so big. Oh, 
right, there is someone streaming Fox that I know. Just stick. I think we're going to raid this guy, just to deck. I don't know if, when was the last time I raided them. <laughs> yep! Thank you very much for being with me today. It was a short but fun little stream. And I hope that you enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot and... I'm going to now fall into bed because it was quite a long week. <laughs> if you have any requests for my birthday week, please let me know. So I can take notes and plan ahead what we are going to do. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful weekend with lots of love, kindness and respect. And that you're going to show up tomorrow for Bar Trauma and Foxhole. Or on Sunday or on Monday. We're gonna have a lot of fun together, I hope. Stay awesome, guys. And thank you, thank you very much for being so active and so great with me. I'm, I, I'm learning so much and I'm having so much fun with you guys. It's really awesome. Thank you. Well, stay awesome, guys, and see you next time. Bye.